the guys, and welcome back to Civilization 5. We are still 5% behind on literacy. I don't know how she's managed to maintain this lead. All things considered, with the bonus we get from Scholars in Residence, don't know. But somehow, she's still there. She's still ahead of us. Um, but, I mean, the war's going pretty well so far. We've sunk the majority of her fleet, although it's... Uh, it's definitely been a little on the expensive side for us, but not too bad. I mean, we're still we're still skint. That's that's the killer there. Is we're still skint. We've got a bank coming in Thebes. Um, we've just taken Salzburg, so that will be raising in one turn. That's nice. Okay. Um, so yeah, we need to sort of punish her front line. So, uh, keep Thebes safe, basically. Finish off her fleet. Just do what we can, really. It's just a matter of whittling her down. And hoping that uh, we can keep our promoted artilleries alive. Because that's going to be the real sort of... Ace in the hole, as it were. <sighs> that fucking plane is annoying, though. It's really annoying. We need to, like... I think we chose a good time to declare war on her. If we'd left it much longer, those planes would have been killer. They might be taking out one of our units here. They have. Okay. That's fine. That's fine. It's all good. It hasn't increased our GPT at all, but... Whatever. I mean, they're taking some shots at Austin Inca. I mean, they can whittle its health down all they want. They're not going to do any real damage to it. You know? It looks like Larsa might be wanting to come over and pillage some stuff, though. So I'll just quickly put a stop to that. Are we at war with Larsa or are they friendly? They might actually be friendly. Um, let's start just by getting rid of some of this and that. I think I tried to place an ironclad but there's no space for it to move into. So what happens? I don't know what happens in that situation. That's interesting. Uh, let's bomb this motherfucker. Uh, let's pull the ironclad out of port. Uh, you're gonna shoot that. Are we at war with you, Larsa? No, we're not at war with Larsa. That's fine then. I wish it would stop fucking spinning me over there. Uh, right, let's bring you over there. And what we want to do is take this guy down. Where's that other ironclad that's coming up? It would be a major. And we'll bring you forward and just leave you there as bait. What else have we got over here? You are okay. So what happened to the ironclad? What happened to it? That's what I want to know. Oh, we've got one turn on it. Okay, let's just do it. It's the first time I've seen that happen as a thing, so I don't really know what the rule is regarding that. I guess we just choose. A, we just have to delay a turn. We lose a turn's production or something. Uh, what have we got over here? We've got a whole bunch of stuff. What can we hit with our artillery? Let's shoot that guy. I want to do as much artillery fire as we can, really. Yeah, let's keep using the artillery to bombard these guys and force them to come towards us. There are cannons, though, which are a bit annoying. We could do with charging the cannons. We're going to sacrifice that guy just to get rid of that cannon. Oh, as, as if that didn't fucking kill him. Can you get to him? No. You can take that guy a little bit. Let's do that. Then he can finish it off. We might have to do a little bit of a push and retreat. I, I don't want that cannon just sitting there taking shots at everything. That's the thing. Because that would be really fucking annoying. I'm going to cross him over the river. 
Uh, you're going to stay there for a turn. You're going to go up there. Are we at war with Zurich? Yeah, we are. Okay. Okay, then. Right. What have we not done? We've got a few units healing. And that's about it. Ideally, we need to start sending some reinforcements over there, but we've got to get control of the seas first. Oh, there's another boat there. I didn't see that. Hopefully it'll attack this ironclad and we can just turn around and crush it. Bloody hell. And we're definitely losing riflemen here. But that's okay. That's why I want to sort of pull them back, but I wanted rid of the fucking cannon before I did that, really. going down there. God, they're bombarding that little Gatling gun. Oh, and they're having a... Zurich are having a bit of a, a fight. Fucking hell, half health of one hit off a fucking city-state is ridiculous. Stupid bloody game with its stupid bloody rules. Right. What can we hit here? We can hit you. Let's do that. Let's get the Gatlins on its ass. Is that gone? It looks gone. Right. Kill that one. Oh, she's got one going for the capital. Oh, that's annoying. Send him out to kill that one. Oh, I can't afford to buy one in the capital. That's annoying. Fuck. We're going to have to chase it down. Uh, send you over. Uh, what else do we need to do? Don't need that. That's weird. Uh, and then we've got some promotions. This guy might have to take an insta heal. Let's see first what we can do. Can you hit anything? No, right. I'm going to move you forward. Can you hit anything? You can hit him. Okay, don't do that yet. What can you hit? You can hit him. Hit him and kill him. I'm then going to move you up. So that I can move you there. And you there. Set up. Uh, let's move you there and heal. I want to bring this guy around to heal as well. Fucking Zerg, so much damage. Uh, right, General, let's pop the General there for a sec. You're going to charge that cannon and then that's got rid of him. He was definitely the, the worst. He's got five workers over here. Five fucking workers. That is absurd. Let's pillage some of this shit. Just to allow us to heal up a little bit. Right. Um, how is she doing on soldiers? Fucking hell, how's Venice got 107,000? Shit. I don't know how they can afford the fucking upkeep on them. We're spending 114 in unit maintenance. That's with the 33% reduction. That's fucking insane. I have to keep whipping out these stock exchanges. I mean, we've got a few of those buildings, so hopefully our gold's going to start going up soon. But Jesus Christ, it's a lot of money. She's ready for peace. <gasps> Look at this. Oh my God, she's willing to give me everything. Wow. She is obviously very low on soldiers. 
He's obviously not got much left. I mean, neither do we really, but as long as we've got those artilleries, we can just continue pushing. It's pretty much all we can hope for. But I could do with Droid. Oh, I need to. I need to fucking get rid of Tiwanaka. It's just such a pain. I think. There's more cannons up there. Look, but they're not. She's not pushing them down, which is odd. Uh, this Gatling got promoted, which is nice. I'm gonna send this boat down here to guard the capital. I don't know where her boat went. Uh, don't need that. Oh, man, Jesus, he's close on health. It's those fucking planes. That's why we need to get this city down ASAP. We're just going to keep pushing forward. Pull you to not very far, unfortunately. What can you do? You can't do anything. You need to go further forward. So we're gonna have to. We're gonna have to push our line of riflemen forward. I might leave this guy there. He might have to take take one for the team. If I do that. And at least he's got a fighting chance, which is about as much as I can do for him, really. Um, Goddamn fucking barbarians. Fucking brutes as well. Why are there still even brutes at this stage in the game? Uh, right, spare Gatlin. I could do with sending you to Portugal, really. At the very least, sending you to Mogadishu. There's a mountain in the way, though, so you'd have to go via Jerusalem. There's so many fucking mountains. I don't know. Stay there for now. We'll come back to you. Uh, you are on seek and destroy for that goddamn boat, you guys. Where did he go? I want it found, I want it killed, I do not want it floating around in the middle of the fucking sea ready to pop out and surprise me. Right, you are staying there for now, as are you. You need to push. Uh, you need to push. Let's go that way. And can you get over there? No. Okay, fine, bring up the rear. Into heal, into alert. Uh, okay, 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 okay. We know there's more boats out there. As soon as these ironclads are healed, we'll send a few of them out. Because we could do with getting a clear line across the seas uh, so that we can get people, get reinforcements up in this bitch, is what I'm thinking. Uh, we're back to 16 GPT. Can we buy any faith buildings in here? No. Can we buy any faith buildings anywhere else? We can get a mosque. Let's get a mosque. There we go. Alright. Next turn. It's going to be a long, slow war. This is the problem. It's like late game war in Civ is such a fucking grind. We're going to have to take. We're going to probably gonna lose another rifleman here. We're going to take Tiwanaka down next turn. Then sit and heal and try and just pick off some of her units. But we really do need some reinforcements. That's the hard part. There's the rifleman gone. Didn't see a plane attack that round. Maybe it's a bit damaged. Alright. Don't care about all those. Don't care about that. Don't care about that unless it's going to see. No, it hasn't. Rifleman destroyed. Fine. Let's fucking get rid of this bloody city. Oh my god, it's a little bit more hardcore than I thought. 
probably going to take us another fucking turn to do. Uh, right. Oh, Jerusalem is not our friend. I'm going to have to try and creep past it with that guy. Leave you there on barb duty. We've got another full ironclad. Let's swing that out this way. And another one. Excellent. Let's get them down there. These two guys are still looking for that Portuguese boat. It has to be somewhere. Um, you can set up. You can cross the river. I'm not going to get you to attack. You're going to stay there. For the next round. And then we can bring these guys up the rear. Okay. Taking down cities. It's such a slow process. But we can do it. We can definitely do it. We got over here, it's technically our land as well, so once we've taken this down, we can stand here and heal. Oh, she's pushing forward with some rifles, though. That's interesting. Oh, I can't believe they just swung that fucking boat in. Jerusalem privateer, fuck off. We're going to have to send some ironclads up there, teach Jerusalem a lesson. Fuck knows where that Portuguese ship went. We'll keep an eye out for it. Right, let's get these guys doing something good. There's no point attacking the city when we can kill some dudes first. Can you kill him? You can. Okay. Let's get you to weaken all of these riflemen. Because that will make me very happy. And it will make life on the front line that much easier. You can push in, because that's our territory, so you're safe there. And then I'm worried about that cannon popping down. Can't do anything about it right now. There's another backup rifleman, so we'll push him up that side. Oh, what's this? Whose boat is this? A Zurich ironclad. Unlucky Zurich. That's an expensive loss for you. Let's send these two guys up to clear the way near Jerusalem. Because he's now pretty fucking injured. Um, you need to move forward. I'm going to move you there. In fact, yeah, let's take these decisive victories so that we're in position, except for you. You're going to... Do I want to heal? Healing would probably be the best thing. I know it's a waste of a promotion, but she's the last opponent. It's not like we need to carry promotions through any further than, than what they're at now, you know what I mean? It's like this is the time to use the heal promotion if you're ever gonna. Um... Just be a minor victory. I do need to move you though onto that one. Okay. I'm getting there. We are getting there. I wonder where she moved that other fucking boat to. It's going to turn up somewhere really annoying. I can just tell. Here come a few cannons. <clears throat> Cannons, man. If we can get rid of that territory, that'll hurt them. Because then they won't be standing in their friendly territory. And that's going to make it a lot easier to, to keep them, like, you know, stop them healing so much, stuff like that. Um, let's swing this guy down here. Uh, what do I want to do? I want to bombard the city. I'm going to save you to last. Let's start with these lower guys. There we go. 
Oh, he can't even hit from there. You fucking useless bloody thing. You can. And you can. We're going to have to give it a full barrage then, aren't we? Oh, that was a good one. That was a good one. You can't quite take it, can you? No. Oh. So we've got to take two hits. It's worth it though, isn't it, to get rid of the fucking plane. So if I send you first... Oh, that was it. We got it. Liberate the city. Oh god, no. Don't want to do that. It's going to have to burn. It's going to have to burn. <laughs> Shit. Alright, is that five turn burn down? Excellent. So we can heal up in our brand new friendly territory. Let's move you forward. And you as well. Let's move you that way. And let's move this guy. Uh. Do I want to move another square forward? Not really. No, yes, really. Yes, really. Well, we can't be attacked. Let's do it. Because we need to take Cusco. And we need to take Lisbon. <sighs> we are running out of dudes. Move you around there. Uh, I'm going to give you another naval. Let's move this guy slowly. I don't want to end his turn in range of Jerusalem. I'm not sure if that's in range or not. But... I'm going to put one of these Gatlins in Osininka. This guy's fully healed, so I'm going to leave him on sentry duty. You need to heal up, because you're fucked. You have not found that Portuguese boat. So come back up this way. I'm going to bring this one around this side. And we're going to bring a Gatling gun. And give it a little bit of an escort. We'll drop it off over here somewhere. We'll have to skirt past the Vatican. <sighs> Next turn. I mean, it's happening. It's actually happening. Just very slowly. I'm down to one GPT again. I need those stock exchanges. They're taking so long. But they're so sort of vital at this stage. It's getting so expensive. The fucking army maintenance. Which is our maintenance now? 115. I feel like it's gone up even though we've lost units. It doesn't make any sense. Alright, you can stay there. Caravan, just carry on doing whatever the fuck you were doing. Alright. Let's crush some of these dudes, shall we? If we swing you in there... You can definitely take that out. That's nice. One less cannon. Oh, she's got to be hurting now, surely. This boat is now healed, so I'm going to nip back up here. Skirt past Zurich and just see if she's got any more boats around there. Oh, there's one. Oh, yes. Yeah. A couple of boats appear. We'll get them killed. I'm going to kill as much shit as possible at this point. Uh, what has she got left? She's still got plenty of soldiers left. So, we're not out of the woods yet. We now need to guard... We've got to be careful, because I don't want to sneak up from here and taking out the artillery at the back while we're fighting Cusco. So we've got to make sure we keep sight on this area. Which I'm hoping this Gatling will do. I've also noticed this guy sneaking up behind us. And he is fucking strong. If he thinks he's going to come and take a fucking shot at our dudes... 
You can fuck off. Sounds like we just earned a great general as well, which we really don't fucking need. In fact, I'm going to move you across the river, so if he does come to fight us, he has to cross the river to do so. Uh, what are we doing over here? Another great general. Don't fucking want them. God, they're so useless. It spawns them so fast and there's just no need for more than, like, two at most. And to be honest, we don't. We only need the fucking one. I'm going to bring this guy just there and let him heal. I'm going to delete this worker. Put my general to sleep. Because we're going to hold up, reposition, and prepare to march on Kuzco. I'll bring you down a bit so we can see what's here. Alright. Let's have a look at Kuzco. One, two, three. So we need our artillery sort of on this, this line here. So if I bring that one along, and the others can move up in a bit once we've dealt with this Almaty Rifleman who's trying to sneak up and destroy our shit. Uh, what else do I need to do? Have I done everything for this turn? And that's the other thing, it's just there's so much to fucking get through. You feel like you're just constantly... constantly questioning what to do. We've got one stock exchange up, it hasn't done fuck all, to be honest with you. Jeez. We're going to have to have another, another batch of riflemen to, f to fund the war effort. I'm just going to have to keep popping a few out now and again. Did we get the courthouse in Thebes? Yeah, we have. We've got a courthouse. Okay. Man, where did that Portuguese boat go? Motherfucker. We will find it eventually. I think she's not, she's barely even dropped in the score. You know? All that fucking effort. And she's only like 150 points behind us. We've taken off... We own like most of the capitals on the board. We've taken a couple of cities off her and raised them. I'm going to bring this boat back and we'll get it healed. Uh, what do we want to do? I guess we can push forward some of these. He would have to go one closer to be able to attack Kuzco. So really, I want these guys moving into position. That's pretty good. Okay, you stay there. You are on the hunt for Red October. You are going to keep taking down these motherfuckers. I think they're funny, shooting my goddamn riflemen. Uh, we've got an iron mine. Great. Let's go get one of those things on there. You can keep coming this way. Move this boat along. See what we can see. I'm going to leave everyone in position around here. I'm just going to poke that rifleman out a little bit. I'm also going to pull this guy back a little bit so we can get a decent heal on. You're going to heal... Uh, you... Have I given you an order? Yeah, you were watching our backs. Let's bring you that way. Okay. Okay, we've got a rifleman over there. We've got another one building over there. 
About to get a stock exchange in the capital. That's got to help. We're on 25 now, so we'll see what it goes up to once we've got that one in the capital. This cannon can keep shooting this rifleman because he can tank it. He's in our territory. He's healing enough that it's actually not a worry. And next turn, I'm going to blast it with the artillery. Because <laughs> I'm a bastard like that. Uh, let's set you up and just give it a quick nudge. Oh, his wheels fell off. Yeah, fuck it. Whip in there and get rid of it. <laughs> I think if we take Kuzco, we can probably raise these two cities without too much. In fact, that's a city state. We can liberate that. And then we can just raise Machu, which isn't too much trouble. And then we've just got to swing down and take Lisbon. But we could pull our entire fleet in to help take Lisbon. That would be pretty cool. By the time we've taken this and healed up a bit, we can swing the whole fleet in. Bombard Lisbon, just suicide ironclads at it. And then all we've got to worry about is Vienna. That would be pretty fucking sweet, would it not? I think the answer is yes. It would be pretty fucking sweet. Alright, we are almost ready to push. What are we missing? We've got three dudes. Should we do it? Should we just swing in and do it? Yeah, let's fucking swing in. One, two, three. This one's going to have to get another square closer. There we go. Uh, that one is in range and can attack. <sighs> Exciting. You need to move another square. You're going that way. You're staying there. Or should we move you forward one? Let's move you forward one. I'm ready to take the city when it falls. Nope. Oh. This guy has been promoted. I'm going to give him another naval one and destroy that one. My burning encampment has spawned right in the centre of my shit, obviously. Why would it not? Uh, let's swing you up that way with your escort. Oh! God damn it. Zurich, Zurichian privateers. How many of those have they got? We've killed thousands of them and they just keep coming. Hopefully these guys have got what it takes to tank whatever Kuzco is going to throw at us. I feel like we're in a good position. What's wrong with you? You've built your stock exchange up to 40. Nice. Okay, that helps a lot. I would love a hydro plant, but my god, 3GPT is not something we can afford right now. Uh, especially as we need rifles. Keep pumping those goddamn rifles out. Uh, what is this? Thebes. Also built a bank. That's why the GPT went up so much. We've got two lots of things. Thebes really needs a fucking factory, amongst other things. It needs everything. Let's rip out stoneworks. That's nice and easy, and it gives us a little bit of everything. Uh, you are building lumber mill. What else? Anything else we need to be aware of? I don't see anything else too bad happening. I didn't realize we're actually allied with Milan. Well, friends with Milan. Now then, how much is this going to hurt? This is the big thing. If it's more than half... No, it's not more than half. Excellent. And we've got a suicidal worker down here. It's fine by me. We'll have him. And sell him. What is this? Is this that fucking Portuguese boat? I think it might have been. Oh no, barbarian privateer. Wow. Fucking barbs. A bunch of dicks. Right. Can you... Yes, you can. Excellent. That's him dealt with. 
Uh, who can attack? You can. You can. You should be able to. Oh, beautiful. We need to swing you out the way so that you can come in and set up. We can sell that worker. We need to heal. So if we pillage and heal, uh, you need to kill that bastard. Oh, he's not quite dead. Okay, that's annoying. Swing this guy up from the back. Uh, you are heading up there to sort out the barbarians. You need to come back and heal, but I'm going to leave you there because you're going to help the rifleman get over. Aha! Uh -huh. Look what I've spotted. Let's actually bring you over so we don't lose him this time. Uh, right. You guys all just need to chill. You, I'm going to sit you in that pass. Oh my god, right. Two more turns from a policy as well, that could be helpful. Could be beneficial to us. This is already a long drawn out war. Oh, don't kill that fucking unit. Look at these bastards, have they got two, two tile range? Fuckers. Oh, wait up. What's Zurich up to? Another barb camp, obviously. More workers. They're just suiciding on me. Suicidal workers. Barb camp over there. That's fine. Don't care about that. Not my problem. I'm gonna do a little bit of damage to that frigate. Uh, let's dismiss that. Right, this should be the turn where Kuzco falls, surely. I don't think it can stand a second barrage of artillery. Oh yes, it did not like that. And boom, Kuzco. We did it. We did it, guys. We have Kuzco. Uh, we are going to... Oh, fuck it, just annex it. Can't even be asked. we'll just annex it. Um, Grand River has finished a stock exchange. Let's whip out another rifle. Uh, you guys... I'm going to sit a few of these guys around here. Because we can probably take those two um, two upper cities without too much resistance. I don't think they're going to be difficult to take. Uh, you're okay. You can stay there. Choose production. In Kuzco, we will pick courthouse. Uh, I'm going to swing you up there. We're going to capture and sell a whole bunch of these workers as well as as the uh, opportunity arises. Uh, you're okay. Okay, I think we're doing pretty good. We've made a significant dent on her. How's she doing? She's still not lower on soldiers than Vienna. Holy fuck. How many more units can she possibly have? It does it does it is worrying when you kill that many units, crush that many cities, and she's still still in pretty good shape. It's gonna be it's gonna be a glorious feeling when we finally fucking vanquish her. Although we're probably not gonna entirely kill her outright. I just wanna get these two cities dead so that they're not up my arse when we go for her. I don't like defending on one front whilst fighting on another, it's just too awkward. Um, but then, 
But then, we only really need Lisbon. I wonder if we could just... If we push down towards Porto, I bet she's got another fucking city here, but we can take Porto just so it's out the way, and then just... We need to swing our entire fleet over. We need to heal the fleet, though. Oh, God, it's just time-consuming. So time-consuming. Uh, let's take another cover on that one. Uh, I, need to, I need to relocate all of these in such a way that we can take these cities. Give that guy a turn to heal. That's the other thing. We've got to wait for people to heal as well. We can delete that worker. Swing the artillery's up. Bring the general. This guy is going to be the guy who guards Cusco. Sorry, he's the worker that's going to fix what we pillage. This guy's going to guard Cusco. And this guy, I'm going to bring him up, but he's going to stay there just to watch the rear for now. I'm swing my boats over here because they can heal in my waters that are just here. I'm going to keep dogpiling this guy. I'm going to bring them all down, heal them up. Ferry over some reinforcements. Um, and then send the fleet to, to Lisbon. <sighs> maybe, just maybe, they can help. Okay. Let's put that guy there for a turn. We do need to do a little bit of healing. I mean, Mesa City States haven't been more annoying, to be honest. I was half expecting him to just march out into our territory and fuck us up. You are not getting peace. Oh my god, are you not getting peace? Oh, I fucking. When we captured Cusco, the number of culture we needed for our next thing went up. So that that the policy. The only thing we have. Another fucking great merchant. <laughs> That policy that brings it down, each city you found applies to cities you capture. Because the cost has gone up for capturing the cities. Um, where's that great merchant? Oh god, have we got anyone that doesn't hate us? What about Larsa? They're fucking miles away, but... What route is he going to take? That's okay, as long as he's going past our roads. Let's send him to Larsa. We'll get some cash out of it. Uh, what happened here? Spy has been recruited. Let's deal with that. Not that we can do much with him. There's no one left to spy on. Uh, okay. Right. Let's sort this out. We only need a couple of rifles to take these guys. Oh my god, they, she just had a great general sitting there. <gasps> Silly bitch. That was a mistake. That was a huge mistake. Can't believe she did that. That was crazy. I want to liberate Singapore, raise Machu, swing about face. Ooh. Ooh, what's this? A great fucking war infantry? You fucking kidding? An Austrian musket man? What are you doing sniffing around, you fucking musket man? Let's fucking bombard this twat. Sharpish. I'm also taking that worker. Man, this guy is tough. Ah, oh, bugger, bugger, bugger. We're in our territory, though. Can we move, set, and fire? No, we can't. Fuck! Fuck it. Attack him. Oh. 
What am I looking at here? You. I'm going to set you up and just leave you there in case he moves any closer. God damn, just when I was about to march off as well. That would have been bad. If we'd have fucking marched and just left this one guy, that would have been a right pain in the butt. Thank God we were watching. Oh, what turn is it? 5.16. We'll take one more turn and then we'll call it, I think. I'm stressed as fuck and we're going to need money to start upgrading to Great War Infantry in 15 turns. Because we need to upgrade all our rifles that are over there, like, ASAP. Um, because we can't just let her... We, we can't face Great War Infantry with just regular riflemen. We'll be fucked. Um, it just isn't feasible. Let's just give it another poke. There we go. And there's a decisive. Jeez. She's got great merchant over there. I'm going to keep an eye on that. Because if she puts it in the sea, I'm having it. <laughs> Alright. Heal up my boats. Heal up my boats, and then they they'll be ready to swing around. I can probably send this guy out now. God, there's so much to do. At least we get a new policy. That's a nice way to finish off this app. Uh, right. Two, three. You need to move one close. So let's also bring you back up. And you up as well. Move the general up. Move, we can move this guy up. Just a little bit. Uh, and that one, I'm going to push him up there. You can move back to that worker and stay there for a sec. You're getting deleted. I'm going to move you up. Oh, that's why he built a city there. Look, there's fucking Air's Rock. Fucking Uluru, just sitting there. And you're going to wait a turn. Right. That's the troops dealt with. Uh, cheese production in Stockholm. We've got another stock exchange up. That's very nice. Uh, what do we want? I feel like we could really use a hydro plant in this city. So I'm going to do that. Uh, and then we're going to adopt a policy. So we've got some options. I mean, there's representation, but I don't know how much further we're ahead to another policy we're really going to get. Um, so it feels a bit shit. Don't really need any of the rationalism tree. What's our top one here? Oh, that. Klauswitz. Oh, ne it never pops up at a good time. So really, we want another one of these. Which are all cack anyway. What else have we got? What does Honor do? Go for enemy units killed. We could get the 50% more experience, that would be nice. We've also got commerce, plus two for more land trade routes and reduced road maintenance. That could help. Let's do that. Let's get the wagon trains. That's a nice bit of a gold boost. Look at those maintenance costs. It's fucking ridiculous. <laughs> it's absolutely absurd. Right, that's where we're going to leave it then, folks. Um, we're just having a quick scan to make sure there's no nasty surprises. So the idea is we'll heal up the fleet, and then we can swing the whole lot down through this strait here, because Milan is our friend. And as we march downwards, what we do is we'll liberate Singapore um, and raise Machu, then there's nothing up our arse. We'll march down the with the, the goal of like raising Porto as we go past. 
um, and swing the fleet in and sort of hide them around here. And when we attack Lisbon, we'll like throw boats at it. That's the plan. Uh, but for now, I'm going to leave it there. And we'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.